Hello and welcome to another quick newly video about KSB News, version 0.22. Science, that is what 0.22 is all about. We have at least four new parts and a new building for research. It starts with experiments, or a crew report, which gives you data. The data can then be transmitted through existing communication parts, through this new dish, or recovered along with a vessel returned to Kerbin. Once you have this data, you get science, which you can use in the new research and development building to unlock tech nodes, giving you access to new parts and later tech nodes. There are currently 42 nodes with two parts unlocked with each node, and a few extra nodes set aside for modders. There's more info about how this stuff works, but I don't want to waste time droning on and on about it, so look in the description for it. Also, there's a video going over these things in a bit more detail made by Squad themselves, link in the description. A few quick other things to note, Sub-Assembly Manager, you know that great mod? Yeah, there's going to be a stock form of it now. The Avionics Package, which was rendered useless by 0.21, is going to be turned into an Atmospheric Science Module for gathering data during flight. Along with this, there are some tweaks for how batteries are recharged by engines, and UI tweaks. For instance, you should now be able to see what mode the SAS is in, and be better able to predict its behavior. It's also being improved. Going back to the new KSC, you might have noticed the runway looks a little different. Finally, we have runway lights at night. And that's about everything new for now. I've left out some details, as I said, so look down there in that description thingy for links to my sources and more info type things. Thanks for watching and fly sa- wait, no, that's still someone else's outro. Become a viking- wait, no, that's definitely not mine. My name is Kurt, I- wait, no it's not, that's not my name. Uh...